Welcome to Frank Bruno Law. I'm Frank Bruno. I'm an elder law and estate planning attorney in New York. How useful is the power of attorney? The document itself can be very useful for the limited purpose that it's designed for. I had an issue uh, today where um, a, uh, an elderly person with the onset of Alzheimer's was, has been taking money out of her account. Um, her adult child with the durable power of attorney went to the bank to try to prevent the mother from overly withdrawing funds. So the thing is, the daughter could pull money out. The daughter could use the power of attorney to um, actually uh, take all of the funds out. But the power of attorney cannot be used to limit the mother from taking her own money out of the account, right? So the only way to prevent the mother uh, from being able to access her very own account is to is for someone in the family to prosecute an adult guardianship, right? So an Article 81 guardianship where uh, some member of the family would go to the court and uh, based on uh, a set of stated facts, such as my mother is uh, constantly taking money out of the account and taking it out inappropriately, right? Taking the money out, squandering it, uh, using it uh, really uh, in a way that's not in her own best interest. So the durable attorney, power of attorney is useful for the daughter to go to the bank for the mother, for the adult child to um, take financial transactions on the mother's behalf, but it does not permit the agent in the power of attorney to go to the bank or the financial institution and prevent the mother from acting against her own best interest. For that, uh, the family member would have to do a guardianship. If you'd like to speak about any particular elder law issue, please reach out to me, call Frank Bruno.